Hi, I'm Sarah, and today I will be talking about Cape Bird. Cape Bird is located about 400 miles off the northwest coast of Africa. This is Cape Bird, and this is its capital, called Prayer. Cape Bird is an archipelago in the North Atlantic Ocean, and it was first discovered by the ancient Fionans, then colonized by the Portuguese. Cape Bird consists of 10 islands, which are split into two different groups. One of the groups are the Barlaventos, or the Windward Islands, and those islands consists of Santo and Teo, Seo Vincent, Santa Luis, Seo Nicola, Sal, and Boa Vista. The second group of islands are the Sota Ventos, or the Leeward Islands. And those consists of Mayo, Santiago, Fogo, and Brava. Total population of Cape Bird is 434,669 people. Today I will be making papaya candy, or as they call it in Cape Bird, Dulce de Papaya. Papaya candy was first introduced in the, first, in the 15th century by the Portuguese. And they enjoy it because it's a classic dessert of papaya. So, here are the ingredients. Two and a half pounds of firm papaya. Two pounds of sugar. And some lemons. So for the tools for making the papaya candy, you need a cutting board, a large spoon or an ice cream scoop for scooping out the seeds, a smaller sort of knife for cutting off the rind or the skin, and the bigger knives for cutting the actual papaya. Now this knife has a more of a dull tip, and this knife has more of a sharp tip, and you can use whichever one you prefer. Also, you need some sort of grater, like a cheese grater or a lemon zest maker. And the lemon zest is just the skin of the lemon. And then also some sort of shape maker for your candy. Um, right now I will be using a melon ball maker. It's a papaya. And I have never seen a papaya before. So I cut it open. And this is what the inside looks like. Now, inside are these little ball things, which are seeds actually. Now they are very slimy or squishy and they smell kind of bad. Like I can smell it from here. So anyways, the first step is you take your ice cream scoop or any spoon and you have to take out the seeds and cut a thin strip in it. Then. What you will do is you will take your smaller knife and cut off the sides. Okay, then you take this and place it into your pot. And you will keep doing that for the whole time. Now that I have cut up all the papaya and placed them all into the pot, what I'm going to do now is take my bag of sugar and I'm going to pour it into the pot. Now this is four pounds of sugar here, so I'm gonna use about half of this bag. Now that you've poured in your two pounds of sugar, you wanna stir it a little bit until it kind of looks like this and you can see the papaya. Then you wanna put it on low heat for 10 minutes. Just in the 10 minutes. You just take it and you hold it like that and you grind it on the thing.
and let it sit for half an hour to this cool. This is the lemon zest and after cooling for half an hour we have to pour the lemon zest in and stir it. Then what you will do is you will turn it up to a high flame. What you will do is you will let it cook until it's at a crystal that, I used my melon ball maker to make um, the shape of the candy and I put them on a tin foil lined cookie sheet. I let them cool for about an hour or two and this is what I'm they look I'm going like. to try one. That's really good. It's like taffy. Kind of tastes like caramel, I guess. But it's really good. Thanks for watching my video, and I really hope you enjoy making your papaya candy and especially eating it. Bye!